Alan, how are you feeling after that one? Obviously, you're never happy when you, you lose a game. Um, first half, there wasn't actually that much between the teams. We actually played well at times in some good areas, um, but they were really clinical. They took their chances, good finishes, um, and that's what happens when the team's playing with a lot of confidence and scoring a lot of goals. Two goals in the space of five minutes again. Is that, you know, you don't want that to become a habit that when you lose one, you're losing the second quick? Ah, no, we got a clean sheet last week, so I wouldn't mean, read too much into that. They're just good good finishes. That's all you can really, there's not much you can do if we finish it well, but obviously we can defend it better as well. We've got to get closer to people, kind of allow people to get a free shot at the edge of the box. Um, at that point, people have got to be tight, stop shots. Um, obviously, they've got a big team as well. Set pieces was always going to be difficult to to manage, uh, but the boys competed. Um, we've still got to work to keep them there. Goals do change games, and getting the first one in this division kind of always proves that kind of crucial to it. Uh, it's hard. Uh, it's a hard place to come. Uh, they're playing with a lot of confidence, as I said. They've got good players. Um, it wasn't a lack of effort. It was just sometimes picking their own pass, that wee bit of quality sometimes. Um, but there wasn't much between the teams. They were just they took their chances better than us, especially first half. It is about confidence, as you say, and after last week, you were hoping to come here and, and get that bit. You could see that the confidence, the, the way they are playing, is that bit more. I don't think they were great, to be honest with you. Obviously, second half, we need to open up a wee bit, and it makes it a wee bit easier. Um, but it was timed first half, we actually passed the ball well, and then it's obviously right before they, they score the second goal, we've got a chance. And there are the wee margins that obviously make a difference in this league. You, you score, it's one each. Instead of that, two minutes later, we're, we're a couple of minutes later, we're, we're 2-0 done. They were, as you see, quality finishes this afternoon as well. Yeah, no, they've, they've scored a lot of goals recently, so they've got a lot of goal threats in their team, but we've got goal threats as well. Um, but today we just never really managed to work the keeper enough, and that's what it comes down to, scoring goals. Robbie himself had a couple of good saves, probably three good saves this afternoon as well. Yeah. It's, you're going to expect your keeper to make saves when you come to a hard place like this. Um, second half, I thought the defenders defended really well because we had to open up a wee bit. At times it was 4v4 at the back. Um, and they've got good players going forward, so they managed to defend well. But we know ourselves that we've got to improve. We've got to do a little bit better, show you a bit more quality in the final third, and go and get the goals we need to, to win games. Onwards and upwards? That's it. No, it's uh, every game's massive in this league. And uh, they don't get any. Don't, there's no easy games in this league, and it's certainly difficult uh, fixtures coming up. Did the years that that first fixture coming up on, on Friday night? Yeah, no, we've got to bounce back quick. Um, obviously, Dundee are probably one of the favourites for the division, but we've got to make sure we put in a good performance and try and get the, the three points we need. I think they lost today, so they've probably not made the start that they were hoping for. I don't know. I'm not really looking at other teams. I'm just concentrating myself. All right.